uh, for weight loss surgery. This expands eligibility, helping to improve many weight-related diseases. Joining us today is Chief Medical and Surgical Weight Loss at Hartford Hospital, Dr. Darren Tischler. Doctor, thank you for being here today. Thank you for having me. First, tell us about these new guidelines. What are they? Sure. The uh, new guidelines were developed by ASMBS, the American Society for Metabolic and Bariatric Surgery. And these guidelines replace the original guidelines for surgery, which were established more than 30 years ago. Uh, these guidelines, uh, to a significant degree, increase uh, people's eligibility uh, for surgery if they have, if they're overweight or obese. So it opens the door to more people. What do these guidelines mean for people who are struggling with being overweight or obesity? So what it means is that we're able to treat people at an earlier stage of disease. I like to think of obesity like a cancer. We want to treat it earlier and aggressively and before people have irreversible side effects from it or complications. So what does that mean with these guidelines? We can now operate on people with a body mass index of 30 and above rather than 35 and above or um, with or without health problems. So it, it's really expanding the group of patients and people who would really stand to have the most to benefit from surgery. And this weight loss surgery has gotten safer over the years, correct? 100% gotten safer. Uh, it's, it's, we've invested a lot in technology in this country. Um, the minimally invasive and robotic technology that we have to do surgery today allows us to do surgeries very effectively and safely. And we have a variety of treatment options available today, so we can really custom tailor a procedure for each and every patient who struggles with being overweight or obese. Okay, so somebody's thinking about this and wondering, is this right for me? What should that person do? Well, the most important thing is make that decision that they need to do something for treating either being overweight or obese. And that means either contacting your primary care doctor or contacting any of the bariatric programs that we have throughout the state of Connecticut. And one key part of this also is the, the mental element of this. The patient has to be in the right mm -hmm. headspace to have this done from the get-go, right? Absolutely. And that's what... That, and when you ask about how things got safer over the years, we look at the whole person. This is what we call multimodal treatment of obesity, where we're treating the entire person. We're treating the behavior triggers. We're treating the environmental issues. We're treating exercise. Bringing it all together is what's going to give people the best possible results and help them live longer, and we're going to save lives by doing that. All right, we've got more information you folks do on your website, hartfordhealthcare.org slash weight loss. We appreciate it. Dr. Darren Tischler, Hartford Hospital, thanks for your time today. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you.